Hello and welcome to watching this video. In this video, I want to teach you how you can create heat vision in Adobe After Effects. Okay. First, you should create new composition and add your video. And then select your video here and in window, select tracker. After select tracker, you can see the, this tracker panel here. Okay, now select a track motion. And then change this tracker point to this eye. For example, here is good. Now select this to track forward. Okay. Now you should create a new null, null object, and then um, here select your file and here in edit target select null 3 and then ok and now select apply x and y and then ok very good now as you can see null 1 is track now ok now again select this video and then select track motion and now change this to left eye That's good. Mm. Very good. Uh, from here. Okay, now again select analyze forward. Now you should create another null object and then here in edit target select null 4 press ok apply and then here click ok very good now as you can see here we have two null object track for hit vision now um, turn off show this null object and here create new solid change color to orange and then press ok Turn off show this layer and now select your video. After select your video, you should create a mask around your eye. For example, here. Okay, and now go to this mask, go to here, mask one, change add to none. Very good. Now again, create another mask for left eye to here. And change this mask to none. Now select mask one and mask two. And then in tracker panel, you can see we have mask tracker. Now you must track these two masks. You can use this for frame by frame or you can select this for track all. Uh, now for example here mask 2 is change should around here. Okay now as you can see we mask and we track these two masks from here to here. Okay, now you should just select mask 1 and mask 2 and press Ctrl X for cut these two masks. Or you can here select cut. Okay, when you select as you can see cut these two masks and now select this orange solid and then press Ctrl V or you can here edit select this paste. Very good. Now when you turn on this orange layer you can see uh, we have these two masks and now here in mask you should change mask you want to add and change mask two to add okay very good now in these two masks change feeder to 10 
button and change the speed there 10 that's good and now in more change it to add very good and uh, for example from um, here in transparent um, in opacity insert two frame from here um, zero for example to here change it to 100 okay now create a new solid and then press ok and in effect select video copilot saber you can download and install this video copilot saber is free you can find it in video copilot website okay now here in preset select um, for example you can use core okay that's good and now in render setting in composite setting change black to transparent now as you can see here we have two point you should change this point for example to here and another point change it to here now in distortion um, glue distortion change flight to energy and in core distortion change um, okay it's energy too it's okay now in um, glue distortion change this wind speed to 10 and in core distortion change wind speed to 10 too. and in wind direction change it to 180 and for this for core distortion 182 and uh, for core distortion change distortion amount to 10 okay that's good and now just uh, in composite change composite in um, good distortion change composite to multiply very good now here as you can see we have two point this point is uh, core end and this point is start um, core start okay now turn on these two null and as you can see for example this null is for left eye now you should open this group in null 4 and then here in core end hold alt and then click core end okay now here as you can see it's automatic open this expression about core end and then you should select this and drag to position of that null as you can see now core end is linked to that null object for example if I change it like this very good and in core end and um, core it starts again press alt and select core start Let's click that and here in core start in expression change it and type wiggle and type I think 10 um, and 25 is good for here okay now as you can see it's a little shake for this heat vision 
and now select this layer and after that in edit select duplicate or control D press that very good and now here open this effect saber and in core end and then we should link this core end to null mm, null 3 for example here now drag this and drop to position for another null okay and select that and in core start change this to for example here that's great now you should change this mode to add for this and for this very good for now when you play that okay, as you can see it's like this it's very good now just you should uh, from for example mm, here now go to customize core and then in start offset for example from mm, Uh, from here insert keyframe in start offset and change it to 100 and for another layer do that um, in customize score A start offset insert keyframe and change it to 100 and then from here for example to here change it to 0 and again in another select change it to zero very good now when you play that it will be like this very good and now for color correction just um, here you can add adjustment layer and in effect mm, color correction you can add levels and adjust um, this color and in utility you can add hdr compander change it to expand range and change it and adjust this color and now when you play that as you can see it's like this very good I hope you like this tutorial. Thank you for watching this video and goodbye.